Hold on, guys. This is stealth mode. We gotta catch Aaron. Aaron! I already need him. Crap. Man, I gotta get this robot done. We only have a couple more days. Jeez. Aaron, this is oh the my... freaking third day that you have not filmed this video. Uh, I need to get the robot done, though. This is more important! Amanda, where are we gonna go film? We need to, like, actually get this video done. Well, I don't really haven't thought of it yet. Do you want to go to Target, though? Yeah, we could probably get some good ideas there. Just, you know, everyone likes a good Target run, right? Mm -hmm. Go with the uh, snow day! It's cold! <laughs> no one taught me love. One taught me patience. And one you like my hair? Gee, thanks. Just this bought it. Aaron, I just thought of one of your weaknesses. You uh, spent so much freaking money at my due to robotics. Eat food. Eat food. Amanda, we gotta figure out how we're gonna raise more money than all the other teams. Wait, Aaron, look it, we're by the cooking supplies. This reminds me of like how you're such a great cooker. Oh my god, yes, we're gonna be perfect because I know how to do a lot of really cool things in the kitchen and we'll be able to raise a bunch of money by making baked goods and stuff. Aaron, we're really good at sponsorships from raising money for robotics. Oh my That's gosh, you're so right. Oh my gosh. Look at all these ideas. All of these people are possible to reach out to. Oh, Aaron, and also look at they have Buffalo Wild Wings. We just um, reached out for a sponsorship from them. Oh my gosh, I eat there so much because of robotics. It's kind of crazy. And all of the networking we've done in the past three years for robotics and the survivors and all of the ties we have to Howl survivors. Yeah, I know. We're going to have an edge over everyone, mm -hmm. which is going to be insane. Aaron, I've been thinking about it. Why do you think we would be good senior survivors? Well, and I think it'd just be a really good opportunity to show like what you and I have and what Brighton has to offer. For sure, and we are super competitive. So I know, we're and energetic. the most competitive people. <laughs> oh, and thinking about it, Aaron, we got so many connections. Yeah, we really do. Like, I have so many friends in the school, whether it be my like band student friends or Same. Even my robotics friends. Same. I know we'll be able to literally have so many people help us with mm -hmm. our endeavors. And we got the staff connections too. We yeah. know so many staff members. I'm on the competitive team for dance. I'm around the county. Oh yeah. Aaron, we we've met so many people from across the world through robotics. It's gonna be insane. I'm so excited. Yo, Amanda, why are we even doing Senior Survivor together in the first place? Oh, I've known you since first grade. It just feels natural to me. Yeah, I know. We work really well together, too. Yeah, and I mean, even though I didn't get invited to your bar mitzvah, it's okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, that looks like our dogs. Wait, do you think he's related to ours as well? Do I don't know. Sibling? I know, literally our dogs are siblings, <laughs> if you guys didn't know. <laughs> But one of our strengths is just being able to survive at the high school for prolonged periods of time. I don't know. Do you think we could build a fort out of this oh, stuff? Oh, definitely. Oh my god. So on a more serious note, we just wanted to sit down in Target <laughs> <laughs> and uh, kind of just talk about why we think it's important to be a survivor and what it represents um, for us. Personally, um, my grandparents really taught me that it was important to give back to the community because the community gives you such um, an important uh, thing in your life. Uh, you need the community to feel part of something, and when you feel part of something, it ultimately gives you um, a place to fall back onto and people to surround you and just keep your health um, up and your life happy and healthy. So, mm -hmm. yeah. I'd say my connection to this is my grandpa, before he passed away this um, this fall, he he struggled a lot with cancer. So he had all of those different things. And lucky, luckily we had the money um, to support this, unlike um, some people that were gonna help, which is awesome. But before he passed away a couple days, he asked if he could donate all of his organs and stuff to give back to the community. And that really hit me and inspired me to really do this. Yeah. Um, another thing is that um, Senior Survivor I feel like we've been kind of like leading up to it our entire high school career. Like, man and I personally have been really involved with a lot of um, school related projects and also trying to take those school related projects and move them towards the community. So, for example, like robotics, we have this giant thing called Chairman's where um, it's connecting our robotics team with. Um, people around the world actually um, and helping and benefiting them whether it be teaching at STEM nights and stuff like that 
Um, so it's really important for um, us personally to connect um, with it. And this is kind of like our mm -hmm. final hoorah. Amanda, stop dancing. Oh my God. <laughs> Amanda, I feel like we have so many good ideas now. Do you think you want to start like filming our video when we get back to the high school? I think we already did. I guess we kind of did in a way. I don't know. I think we had a lot of good ideas. Perfect. I hope Brighton won't be this frozen in a couple weeks. Eric!